वेलकम फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल डिस्कस फ्रैक्शन एट फर्स्ट द मीनिंग ऑफ फ्रैक्शन इज हाउ मच पार्ट ऑफ ए होल बिहेव इज द मीनिंग ऑफ ए फ्रैक्शन फॉर एग्जांपल इफ वी हैव अ ब्रेड एंड वी कट इट इनटू फोर पीसेस सॉरी फॉर इक्वल पीसेस देन ईच पीस कैन बी डन वन बाई फोर वन बाई फोर वन बाई फोर वन बाई फोर एंड इफ यू एड दिस फोर पीसेस देन इट कम्प्लीट द ब्रेड कम्प्लीट द ब्रेड वन अगेन एंड ए फ्रैक्शन इज ऑफ द फॉर्म पी बाई क्यू द अपर पार्ट ऑफ फ्रैक्शन दैट इज पी इज कॉल्ड नोमिनेटर एंड क्यू इज डिनोमिनेटर The important thing we should note here is that a fraction never be written in a negative form. For example, if we write minus three upon four, then this is not a fraction because this is negative. Now, type of fraction. At first. proper fraction proper fraction is a fraction where numerator is less than the denominator for example 3 upon 7 is proper fraction because numerator that is 3 is less than the denominator that is 7 secondly improper fraction in which numerator is greater than denominator for example if you write 5 upon 2 is improper fraction here 5 is greater than 2 that is numerator is greater than denominator thirdly like fraction two fractions are said to be like fraction if their denominator are same for example if you write 4 upon 7 and 3 upon 7 these fractions are like fractions because their denominator are same four unlike fraction two fractions are said to be unlike fraction if their denominators are different for example if you write 2 upon 5 and 5 uh, upon 7 these fractions are unlike because their denominator are different mixed fraction is a joint form of a whole and a part of a fraction for example if you write 7 upon 3 by 2 is a mixed fraction and 7 is a whole and 3 upon 2 is a part of a fraction now we learn how to represent a fraction on a number line at first we will try to represent a proper fraction on a number line so we assume a proper fraction 3 upon 5 and we represent it on a number line at first we draw a number line and give points here 0 1 2 3 and so on because the numerator is 5 so we divide the part between 0 and 1 in 5 equal parts that is 1 2 3 4 and 5 these parts are equal now this uh, uh, we see the numerator is 3 so we count start of 1 2 3 this point is 3 upon 5 this point is 4 upon 5 because this is number 4 that is 1 2 3 4 this part is 2 upon 5 this part is 1 upon 5 and this part is 5 upon 5 that is 1 now we represent 
uh, an improper fraction. And we take here that is 5 upon 3. This is a this is an improper fraction and we represent here on a number line. The procedure is same. At first we draw a number line and give points 0, 1, 2, 3 and so on. The procedure is same we see the denominator is 3. So we make 3 equal parts from 0 to 1. That is 1, 2 and 3. And we also divide the part between 1 and 2 in 3 equal parts also. 1, 2 and 3. Now we see the numerator. The numerator is 5. So we count start from here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This point is 5 upon 3. This point is 4 upon 3. This point is 3 upon 3 and this point is 2 upon 3. Now we will learn how to add, subtract, divide and multiply our fractions. At first we take two like fractions. That is 2 upon 3 and 5 upon 3. And we will add these two like fractions. 2 upon 3 plus 5 upon 3 because their denominator are same so we take here 3 and the numerators can be written as same 2 plus 5 that is 2 plus 5 is 7 upon 3 is the right answer <coughs> and if we add 2 unlike fractions uh, we take here 3 upon 4 and 2 upon 5 and if we add these two unlike fractions then the rule is 2 by 5 is that we uh, at first we multiply cross 3 and 5 3 multiply with 5 is 15 and cross multiplication of 2 and 4 2 and 4 is 8 and here we write the multiplication of 4 and 5 that is 20 and 15 plus 8 is 23 upon 20 is the right answer here we noticed that if two like fractions we add then the denominator will be same in answer but if we add to unlike, unlike fractions then this procedure we can adopt that is cross multiplications and here the multiplication of the denominators now if we divide the same procedure is can be adopted in subtraction of two fractions now we divide two fractions for example if we take 3 upon 5 divide by that is uh, 7 upon 20 then we write here the 3 upon 5 and we change this division sign into multiplication and next we write the reciprocal of 7 upon 20 that is 20 upon 7 and we divide 5 4 and now we cannot write more shortest form of these two fractions <coughs> so we multiply 3 and 4 that is 12 and 1 and 7 that is 7 is the right answer the point to be noted is here is we have to change the division sign into multiplication and the next fraction can be written in its reciprocal form now we multiply 
is the same. For example, if you take 4 upon 8 and 16 upon uh, 5. Now we have to uh, change these two fractions into its shortest form. For example, 4, 8, that is 2, and here 2 multiply with 4 is 8, 5 and 1 is 5. Is the right answer? And if, if, if we have uh, such problem like if it 2 upon 3 of a fraction 9, so we write here 2 upon 3 and we change this of into the sign of multiplication and write down the next fraction as it is, that is 3. 3 and the answer is 2 multiplied with 3 is 6 is the right answer so friends uh, this is all of a fraction and if you think this video is good then please like comment share and subscribe my channel and if you have any problem related to mathematics then you can call comment also so uh, we will meet in next video uh, so till then thanks for watching